Welcome to Puget Sound Garden Life. I'm Allison. My husband Bill is the cameraman today and this is our new homestead. Our seven and a half acres has a little bit of pasture here, but today, actually tomorrow, we have a forestry mulcher coming and they are going to mulch down all of these trees that you see here in our pasture and they're gonna go along this entire fence line, mulch all this down and then also on the opposite side of the fence line. We're excited to show you the before footage of what this place looks like right now. If you didn't see the video of what this pasture looked like before my dad and I took his brush hog to it, you should check that out because where we're standing right here used to be up to here in grass and weeds. And now we're gonna attack that part. So Thanks. if it was up this high, then it would probably be like this. Yeah, thing. you wouldn't even see this little guy. You just see this little fuzz of hair sticking up. No, you just think it's just plants. All right, thanks for watching us today and we hope you enjoy all this fun. Probably a good idea. I don't know about you guys, but I could watch this machine operate all day long. In fact, I did spend a lot of time watching it. It's so cool to watch what it can mulch through and to see how quickly it can change the way an area looks. So this machine is a trapped skid steer, uh, but instead of having a bucket on the front as an implement, it has a forestry mulching head which is a bunch of blades that are stacked together parallel to each other and have super sharp uh, teeth that are on those blades that can be replaced uh, for different styles of mulching. Uh, but it is super impressive and I really hope you enjoy watching it here, working on our property. And I can't wait for you to see them unveil this fence behind all those bushes.
How cool is this that you can now see this fence that's been hiding behind all those bushes, blackberries, and scraggly little trees for who knows how long. If you're impressed with this transformation so far, please give this video a thumbs up. I would really appreciate that. I am super excited about the progress we've made here and I'm really excited to show you what it looks like the next day after he's all done. We were so excited with all the work that the forestry mulcher got done. Here we are the next morning. Bill and I went outside first thing with our coffee in hand to check out all of his work. He even had time to mulch that entire area where I was standing in my bathrobe that was completely full of a giant blackberry patch. And he was able to clear through all that in a super quick time. We are so glad that we hired them to come make quick work of all that brush. We couldn't let the forestry mulching company have all the fun and there is still a ton of work to do on the farm. So my dad came back to put that tractor to work. You can see here in this clip he is removing, it was probably about a 40 foot long fence panel, some sort of corral panel from when this used to be a horse farm. That panel got left in the woods and nature just consumed it. And it was underneath all those blackberries. And of course, we couldn't take the tractor back there with the brush hog until we got that pulled out. So I'm very grateful my dad was here to help. Should we just, yeah, keep pulling it. This is huge. I think it's safe to say that my dad is as happy as a clam back there. He's cleared out all that area already and it's looking great and I think he could just be on that tractor for hours. I'm so grateful and can't wait to see what it looks like when he's done. <laughs>